Since the COVID-19 pandemic lockdown of 2020, Lamb Chop's Spin Along members have gathered virtually on Zoom. We are a gregarious bunch of fiber artists who delight in sharing all aspects of spinning, weaving, and fiber processing. The need to protect everyone's health meant we would not be gathering together or attending public events where we could demonstrate and share our enthusiasm for our craft. The reimagined virtual sheep to shawl of 2020 and 2021 as a timed, socially distanced competition taking place on Zoom allowed us to participate with many spinning and weaving groups in a new way. The challenges of teamwork while apart included relying on fiber, yarn, and the finished shawl being delivered on time in the mail. Along with the challenges of streaming the whole process live, which Lambtown Festival hosted with an extended schedule allowing teams to work independently and the public to watch safely from their homes. The new challenge for virtual teams in 2022 is the production of an educational video sharing the process of creating our shawl. Most Thursdays, Lamb Chops Spin Along join the Zoom channel for crafting and discussing sheep to shawl ideas. We talk over design themes, weaving drafts, and dye techniques. In the past, we had dyed warps and painted warps, but what about a stencil painted warp? We talk about what fibers to use and how to process them. Blueface Leicester and Tessa Silk Blend was chosen for the warp for its ability to accept dye well. The design of wings was decided on and a stencil cut. The warp painting was tested on a sample shawl woven of millspun yarn. Discoveries were made. The image design and dye technique refined and we were ready to begin our shawl. This would be for Laura, our tallest member, so the wingspan needed to match her height and arm length. She wanted the design to evoke a ceremonial dance shawl for Hummingbird Clan. To create the shawl, it had to be woven twice. The warp was spun, plied, and wound onto the loom and stabilized with a temporary weft. Then it was pulled off the loom and onto a long table where the stencil could be put in place. Laura and Sayla painted the wing design with chacard acid dyes that were thickened with sodium alginate to prevent the colors from spreading uncontrollably through capillary action. The tips of the feathers were dyed golden yellow, followed by hot fuchsia, violet, and turquoise at the center. The stencil was cleaned, flipped, and the process repeated to form the second wing. The warp was left in place for approximately four hours to set the dye. It was rinsed, dried, the temporary weft removed, then it was wound back onto the loom, finally ready to be woven. The fleece chosen for our weft yarn came from Lyra, a natural colored Romney ewe. She was the grand champion of Black Sheep Gathering in 2019. The clean washed fleece was hand teased by Judith and passed to Terry for drum carding into smooth bats ready for spinning. The bats were shared by Laura, Sayla and Judith. We gathered together for one short afternoon for a spinning circle in Sayla's garden. The singles were plied and loaded onto shuttle bobbins, ready for Sayla to begin the weaving. The weaving begins with a header of temporary yarn to test the weave and give stability to the warp. The hand spun weft yarn is woven for about an inch and a half, then the hem stitching is done to create a clean, finished edge. The simple twill draft chosen for its mimicry of feather texture works well with the painted warp. 
When the center of the wing design is reached, the direction of the twill is reversed to create the backbone of the design. The second half of the shawl is woven, and the woven end is secured with hem stitching and then cut off the loom. The shawl was misted and fold lightly by hand drumming on the whole surface. It was left to rest on the table surface to dry out. Sayla twisted the fringe ends in bundles of three and three ends, plied together by hand for an elegant finish. Our winged shawl was complete, packed and sent on its way to Lambtown Festival. Thank you to all the Lamb Chop Spin Along members who processed, spun, wove, and cheered us along. We appreciate the work that Lamb Town Festival has done to create a virtual sheep to shawl and send our grateful thanks for the opportunity to participate. Yours sincerely, Lamb Chop Spin Along. <laughs>